Oh, hold it right there. You were very, very mean to me and hurt my feelings today, and I'm not sure that I even want to talk to you yet. I came here to apologize. I have been blowing you off a lot lately, and there's no excuse for it. I'm a selfish, rotten person, and I'm sorry. Is that it? <laughs> Roseanne. Oh, all right. I'm such a softy. And to make up for being such a jerk, I want to take you to a movie. Just you and me, my treat. Okay, well, you'll have to go put on a better shirt. Why? We're going to a movie. No, you feel way worse than that. You're taking me out to dinner, too. Fine. You think Darlene would mind if I went upstairs and borrowed something? No, as long as you put everything back on the floor where you find it. Hey. What's my comic book doing down here? DJ got caught with it at school today. We have to talk. That's it. Hire a hearse, pick out a plot. DJ! <laughs> Jackie. Well, some say environment, but I think she's born that way. <laughs> no, I mean, was she like in an accident or something? No. Why? Well, I saw her upstairs and her back's all bruised up. She didn't tell me nothing about it. Sorry for yelling at you like that, Darlene. You scared the heck out of me. Are you okay? Yeah. You ready to go? Come here. What? Darlene says your back's all bruised up. No, it's nothing. Well, then let me see. No, don't. Come, Come on, stand still. Well, Darlene, you get out of here. What's going on? Now, Darlene. Look, I'm all right, so don't go blowing this up into something it's not, okay? What happened? Nothing, let's go eat. No, we're not gonna go anywhere till you tell me how your back got all bruised I up. I told like you that. I'm okay. You come over here, your back is all bruised up, you won't tell me nothing about it. How do I know if you didn't get raped or mugged or something? Does Fisher know about this? Why, why can't you just drop it? That son of a bitch. You don't understand. He beat the crap. No, he didn't. It's no big deal. It's no big deal. What are you saying? He hit you. It's not like he forgot your birthday. We had an argument this afternoon, and he pushed me a couple of times. Not Fisher's fault. Then whose fault is it? I, I can't believe that you're, you're saying, saying that. You don't even listen to me. He said he was sorry, and, and it would never happen again. Damn, Jackie, you were a cop. You heard the same crap a million times. Now you're throwing it out on me. How could you let this happen to you? Shut up! You don't know the whole story. He's been under a lot of pressure lately. There's no work. And I told him that he should look for a job at a bigger company. And he told me that I didn't believe in him. And he told me a million times when he gets in a mood like that that I should just walk away. And I didn't. I just kept pushing him and pushing him. Don't say any more. What happened? Fisher beat the crap out of her. What? I'm all right. I just... I... I don't want anybody to know about it. Is she really okay? Yeah. Come on. We're gonna go wash your face. <laughs> 